guys, this is Courtney Chesney with the Sunshine Team, and I wanted to come on tonight and talk to you a little bit about dysbiosis and vital biome and ProBio5. And um, I am at home with my kids, so if you hear them run in, then I am mommy first, all right? So before I can really talk to you about um, what vital biome and ProBio5 do, let me explain to you a little bit about dysbiosis and what our microbiome is, all right? So a little bit of background information is important to get started. So what is the microbiome? Well, there's about 10 to 100 trillion bacteria that live on and in our body. Don't be grossed out, this is just how God made us. He did it in a wonderful way. But about 95% of those bacteria actually live in your gut, which is insane that there's that much in our gut. But these bacteria are both good and bad, and they affect most every area of our life. Your gut alone contains about 70% of your immune system, which is crazy. So you can easily see how if you get in a state of imbalance, you're gonna have some serious health problems that start to creep up. Guys, listen to this stat. 70 million Americans suffer from digestive diseases. That's about $100 billion in medical bills. That's crazy. Since 1981, fast food sales have increased 2,000 times, and only 10% of Americans actually eat the recommended fruits and vegetables daily. When your gut gets into an imbalance where the bad bacteria start to take over the good, it's called dysbiosis. Guys, we're highly overfed and greatly undernourished in America. And when you add into poor diets an excess of sugar, alcohol, antibiotics, poor sleep, stress, you've got the makings for a pretty incredible imbalance. Each of our microbiomes is as unique as our fingerprints. And everything that we do, what we eat, the air we breathe, substances we put in our body, antibiotics and supplements that we take affects our microbiome in a unique way. It's up to us to create the healthiest microbiome for ourselves. So if you're unsure of whether you might be one of the 60% of Americans that suffer from dysbiosis, just listen to the following list of symptoms. Bloating, burping, and gas after meals, digestive issues, tiredness, fatigue, mental fog, brain fog, immune challenges, weight gain, skin and nail concerns, poor mood. So... I bet you know somebody who hits at least one of those, that somebody might be you. I don't know. Let's talk about that last point that I said, the poor mood. So how does this have anything to do with our gut? Well, your brain houses your limbic system, and that plays a key role in our reactions to emotions. So for all of these years, it's been common to assume that our brain determines our moods. But the more scientists are unearthing the hidden world of the microbiome, it's becoming more and more clear that our gut actually plays the key role in our moods. Why? Because the gut microbes secrete neurotransmitters like GABA, dopamine, and serotonin. Okay? Serotonin is your happy hormone because it boosts your mood. But when up to 95% of the serotonin is actually found in your gut, it becomes more clear why an imbalanced gut actually plays a huge role in our moods. Dysbiosis means your gut is no longer going to secrete, sorry, going to secrete serotonin like it's designed to, and therefore your mood just took a dip. So keeping your gut balanced is key to keeping your hormones and your mood in check. Eating healthy foods, eliminating the bad ones, and probiotics can help with that. So all of that to say, Plexus actually has several products aimed at helping dysbiosis. I'm just going to talk about two of them today um, so that we have a clear picture of what they're for. So ProBio5 is all about the enzymes. Its main goal is what we've always said that it was there for. It's going to get in there and kill off the bad bacteria. This guy balances our bacterial yeast. It also, it's called ProBio5 because it has five good strains of bacteria to power pack your gut as well. But this probiotic is most known for getting out that candida fungus yeast that's in your gut, okay? Vital biome is a true probiotic. It's going to raise the levels of the eight most beneficial strains of probiotics in your microbiome. When these uh, bacteria levels are raised, you're gonna get help with stress hormones, it's gonna improve your mood, 
That's always helpful. It's going to relieve bloating, bowel discomfort, helps reduce GI distress, etc. It contains 20 billion CFU or colonizing forming units and has eight clinically documented strains of bacteria. Okay, so both of these are fantastic. Both are going to help bring your gut microbiome back into balance. They just do it in two different ways. I really like both. I've seen amazing results with both. For anyone just starting out, my recommendation is going to be ProBio 5, okay? Um, I love this product. It's probably my favorite. I, I know Plexus has like a really an amazing lineup of products. This one's probably my favorite. Um, I don't recommend it for someone just starting out on the products though. Um, so let's get that candy. I don't recommend Vital Biome, sorry for someone just standing out on the products. Let's get this one in your body first. Let's get the candida yeast back under control by getting it out of your body. Then you can add in the vital biome as well. All right, so I hope that helps. I hope that explains a little bit about what it does. Um, I've gotten help with um, insomnia. I've gotten help with postpartum depression. I've gotten help with um, cravings because that yeast craves more yeast, which is carbs and sugars. Um, I've gotten help with brain fog, which I thought for years was just mommy brain. Um, turns out it's not. It's just an overgrowth of yeast in your gut. Um, with this one, I really can tell it helps um, like with stress. And on days when I know it's going to be extra stressful, like for the next four weekends in a row, we have missions events every single weekend uh, or every single Saturday. So I'm going to be taking one of these every single Saturday that I wake up. Um, Sundays are always more stressful because I've got to get the kids ready for church, so I take a vitamin in those days. Can I tell the difference in my stress and anxiety with this? I really can. And it's not a placebo effect. I actually can tell a difference. I reached for this um, second thing this morning. Uh, this is what I put in my mouth. I made my bulletproof coffee, took this, took my Slim, and I was good to go. Oh, drank my protein shake as well and was good to go. So anyway, I hope that helps. I hope that makes sense. And um, let me know if you have any questions.